Hello and welcome back to my blind let's play of Rayman Origins. This is our place. We are aiming for the eel, apparently. That is weird. Okay, I'll, I'll aim for the eel, I think. I guess. Oh god, this is more of this chili land business. Please let not don't don't let the next world be a fire world. I do very bad at fire things. Like the, the volcano, the red mountain level in uh, in Mario Kart is like the one I'm worst at. That and the shy guy one. I, I kind of like this though. This is kind of funny. It's cute. It's a cute universe. How can I ever feel bad about this game? Seriously, how can could I ever? This game is just too it's nice and colorful. Okay, now it's kind of red all over, but it's a nice and colorful game with cute art style and good music, and it's just too good. It's just too good. I just can't. So what am I fighting now? Is there some kind of boss in this game or is that not a thing? Are all the bosses gonna be uh, mosquito levels? You're a mean motherfucker. Cause he's a mean motherfucker. Whoop! That is going to be the death of me somehow. More of these looms. Who's even singing these songs? Are the looms sing singing these songs? I can, I can see why they they're putting. Ice cubes in there, though. It's kinda hot. Ow! Well, not in that sense. Ow. Okay. Come on. Get your business. I kinda like that this game doesn't have, like, visible checkpoints. And just goes like, oh, you're not to this point. Okay, that's fine. It's kind of Mega Man like. Very old school. Okay, here we go. Killing these dudes. And there's a thing. Yeah! Breaking the ice, 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 eating some blooms. This game is great. Love it. Please, for the love of everything, open before I die. Yeah! Turning into Gradius. Well, he's dead. He even did the Wilhelm scream. Dog and Dark Cave. Oh, this is Coral Reef. Oh no, not water levels. No, please. How do I change things? That seems very boss like. It's just a hunch that this might be the boss. It might be. I just kill these light bulbs, I guess? Is that like... <laughs> is it here? Does this look like a giant dick? Whoa, whoa, dude! Snappy mouth. 
Not cool. There he is. Snapping at me with his snappy mouth. Show me what you got, bro. Gotta break you! You're gonna die! You're gonna die, bro! Where is he? There he is. There we go! Ha! That's what you get! What's he even shooting? Is he spitting at people? He's spitting very hard pellets of doom! Let's see if we got enough looms for the thing. John and 70 Aww. Not enough. Enough for one of them. We'll get more electune. But not enough for both of them. Aww. I really thought I did well this time. Oh well. I like this little loading screen. It, it, it doesn't allow you to do much, but it does allow you to like play around with controls and get kind of in the mood. For the thing. Here we go. Port O Panic. I like these level names. Is it Port O Panic because everything is on fire? I guess that was happening when your neighboring country is made of entirely out of chili. Oh well. Okay, this is a tilty thing. There we go, Alec Tubes. There we go. Dead thing. What are those are called? What happened to the... Are these supposed to be like fat versions or reimagined versions of uh, the Black Alec Tune from the first game? The world may never know, but I do remember there being some very bitey Black Alec Tunes in, in the first game. Oh hey! What are you? Okay. So I guess this is a frog's home crunch country or something. It's weird. This game is still very weird. Like, seriously, it's weird. Okay, continue on. Oh, hey, it's the ferry! Saving all you guys! But it went on the plane. Not cool, bro. Not cool in the slightest. What the frick was that? Okay, run. Just run, dude. God damn it, Rayman. Yeah, I'm blaming him. Well, would you blame me? But I'm perfect in every possible way. Yeah. Ah. 
Ow! Not cool. Not cool. Okay, that went worse than I had hoped for. Okay! Evil is getting increasingly annoyed with me. Who kept, keeps all these bombs around? At least, is, at least it is true that I fixed this thing. Yeah! Power to dive! Yay! Cool! Here we go. Actually, I had an idea. What's with all these Nemos or the clownfish, I guess? You're a clownfish? Say something funny! <laughs> I love that movie. I really truly do. I've only seen it a couple of times, but... And this music, I don't know if you guys can hear this music, but this music... So damn happy! I love how they're just leaving, but they're synchronized swimming in the water. That is so cute. That is so adorable. What down here? I like tune. Time to save you, bro. Man, what with all these damn clownfish? Go away! <laughs> He's just hanging out, being completely blown off. Yeah, dancing with the little pink things. And then we continue on. More fish. Man, this is... Ah, freak. Under the sea. Under the sea. Oh, it's better down where it's wetter. Under the sea. And then Ariel grew up. And uh, served his... Her, her crab friends. A sandwiches. Just crap fat sa crap meat sandwiches. Have you ever tasted that? That is just delish. Because you wanna eat Sebastian. He's probably big and fat compared to all the crap. By the way, funny story, in uh, in Japan there's this area where all the Crabs have a uh, look like they have a face on their shells, and that's because on the backs. That's because there's like this myth that that if you see a crab with a face on the, their back, it's uh, it's the spirit of a drowned soldier, and you have to let it back. But every time a fisherman in that area finds a crab with like something that looks like a face on its back, they throw it back into the water and and of course the, all those crabs they got descendants because that's the, the that's the type of crab that survived, right? So everyone suddenly got that face on their backs. It's 
kind of weird. But it does tell you a, a, a lot about selection and such. That's of course not called natural selection, that's called uh, unnatural selection? I don't know what, what it's called. I don't remember what it's it, it has a word selection in it. Oh hey, new tricky treasure! Not about nature. I'm still gonna be Rayman. What's out here? Oh, yeah, it's a lady. And she can like she can do the exact same things. So, is that a thing? That's awesome. You know what, I'm gonna play as this chick. But I'm still gonna get that tricky treasure. I want that tricky treasure. In Gourmand Land. The Electoons can open the way! Okay, here we go. I like how she floats with her dress. Very Super Mario Bros. 2 like. That's not Rayman though. This is the chick. I don't know what her name is. Forgive me if she's like an established Rayman type character from one of the games between 1 and, and Origins. If she is, I don't know her. I know one of these characters, the frog guy. Uh, he was on the cover for, uh... Oh, I should just have... I should just have punched that, of course. Okay, here we go. That was kind of dumb of me, I'm sorry. And then I got eaten again. Does she look? Does she run slower than Rayman or is it just me? Yeah! I do feel like she's either slower or something. It does feel a bit slower, it might just be me. I'm coming for you, Mr. Chest! Oops. It would be a little bit easier if there wasn't those red things. Red fish. Watermelon days. And then I got... ...completely eaten by those things. They're really hungry. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Okay, this is getting a bit annoying. Come on, dude. I just want to punch you in the face. Really not that bad. A lot for me, at least. Ow! Again, what is she supposed to be? Is she just like a blue thing that someone doodled on a whim? Because I'd be okay with that, but I'd like some explanation. Actually, in this game I'd like any explanation. There's like none. I mean, the only reason I know this treasure is called a tricky treasure is because it's said on the thing. Oops. All this, all, also, this character's voice is predominantly male. It does sound a lot male. 
I'm okay with that thing, sort of thing though. Totally, but uh, still, still, I'd 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 like to know what's actually going on. It's a cute character though. Come on, man, this is bitrate Roma Roma. Whoa, okay. I don't know what happened to my tongue right there. Uh, um, this bitch trip run all over again. Nah. Come on! I'd really like to know, like, how to do that. I'd like the timing for that, please. Someone tell me the timing for that. Also, tell me the timing for the episode, because thank you for watching the epi this episode of our place. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you join me next time for more shenanigans. Until then, bye!